Yes, Vava is back stronger than before and better than ever. He has come back with more ultimatums, more threats, more plans, and more ideas on how to become president. This time round, there's no voting. Yes, this is his plan. We either change to one of the following three. One, parliamentary system where the parliament vote who the president will be, or we go to federalism. Federalism is where we have stronger federal government. Like the county government becomes semi-autonomous from the national government. That's rendering the national government redundant and not very important in the system. And the third, and that is consociationalism. This is where people sit down and share the government between religious groups, ethnic groups, and among the, along the linguistic lines. So, going forward, in 2027, simply, there will be no voting. I have said clearly that we are not going to vote in Kenya and let foreigners decide who becomes the president. So, we have for five years of running battles between the president of the day and the government of the day so we are running into five years of battle, spirited battle between the current president and the current government and Vava the sixth. Raila will simply be determined to see that in the run up to 2027, BBI will be back in another one. In another. So going forward, Kenyans and the president of the day, William Samoy Ruto, should brace themselves for another version of PBI. So in order to change the Kenyan uh, electoral system from the current presidential system to any of the three that Raila is proposing, then a big amendment of the constitution must come through. Therefore, Raila in the few days will be announcing his next moves and simply he will be looking for ways in which he can change and push for the change of the constitution to see that any of the three methods sees the light of the day. To keep his supporters engaged for five years before they start singing Raila the Sixth, Raila has an elaborate plan to keep his people following him on and engaging the government in various fronts. To start with, Raila Odinga wants all the judges of the Supreme Court to go and he is marching with a million people to go and tell them judiciary wakwende nyumbani.